Historically in Sussex, we had extensive kelp beds all along the coastline. However, over the past 30 to 40 years, these have diminished to almost nothing. In 2021, the Sussex IFCA brought in a new landmark bylaw which excludes bottom toed trawling gear from the nearshore environment. This bylaw will help to alleviate the pressure of that bottom toed trawling gear from the kelp itself in order to give it a chance to restore. A consortium of organisations have joined together to form the Sussex Kelp Restoration Project, whose aim is to monitor and understand the kelp and how it's restoring along the Sussex coastline. In order to supplement the research that's being undertaken, we've created a bespoke recording scheme just for recording kelp on the Sussex coastline. This recording scheme has been created so that we can understand where kelp is, where it isn't, and how it's changing over time. We'd love for you to get involved in the Sussex Kelp Recording Scheme. Whether you're a scuba diver, a snorkeler, a swimmer, a beach walker, a rock puller, or anything in between, the scheme is open to everybody. And we want records of where the kelp is and equally where the kelp isn't. All of that data is really useful to us in understanding the changes that are happening along the Sussex coast and understanding the way in which kelp is restoring. The recording scheme is super simple to use and you can even use it on your phone. We've put together some handy guides as to how to use the scheme and also how to identify the different species of kelp. Follow the links alongside this video for more information.